Welcome to this week's review for It's a Hot Dog. Um, I know you probably already noticed, but uh, we lost one of our behemoths, so there's some uh, skinny gentleman sitting in his place, uh, Matt. He was itching to get on here. We have all kinds of people requesting, but uh, he's a good friend of ours, so we know he likes wieners, so we brought him aboard, and we're going to get his opinion tonight. We went with him because he looks hungry. Yes. Uh, I have to admit, I was concerned picking somebody as skinny as Matt, because yeah. if he trips and falls and lands next to a bun, I'm afraid that Chris might actually consume him. Um, so that made me a little nervous about inviting a skinny guest on here, but... And the last thing I want to do is choke on Matt. Yeah, because uh, um, after last week's episode, hopefully y'all watch, but it was quite alarming. Um, I think Chris has learned his lesson. I'll be more careful. I don't think he's going to try to eat a quarter pound hot dog in two, three bites. Um, we did pick that out of my sink, and it didn't have very many bite marks on it. So it looked like a surfboard with a great white. <clears throat> it was quite concerning. Oh, another public safety announcement. This is for real, no shit. If you ever are choking, um, don't run into the other room like he did, because Kevin and I obviously didn't give a shit. And if he was dying and choking in there, we weren't there to perform the handling. So if you're ever at a restaurant or somewhere in public... Don't be embarrassed that you're choking. Stay around, because if you do need help and you run to the bathroom or something, you're dead. I just so, don't want to do a retake. Yeah, just choking public. And uh, All right, let's get down to this week's dog. Hello, America. I'm Matt, and uh, filling in for Kevin, and got some big shoes to fill, but I literally, big shirt too. I think yeah. I can uh, get it done. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, I've been watching the episodes for a while, and I just... <laughs> I felt like uh, this was a good opportunity to to let the rest of America know that it's not just all about fat guys eating hot dogs, you know. It's skinny guys like hot dogs too, you know. Yes. So I was I was glad I got the opportunity to come on. It's not the, all chubby chasing. And yeah. plus, I felt like you know it was also a good opportunity to let the you know your your lady viewers see that uh, have a little eye candy for the show, if you will. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's. Uh, I've yeah. seen a few women that like Mr. Burns off the center, so it's, <laughs> yeah. cool. it's going to work. It's, uh, it's good. Yeah. Yeah. I agree. Um, anyway, tonight's dog is the uh, Oscar Meyer Natural Angus Beef. We kind of went with a healthier dog for our skinny friend, but so yeah, it's the uh, Natural Angus Beef Selects. Mm -hmm. Headed at Hannaford. It's Oscar Meyer. It's gluten free, oh. antibiotic, no nitrate, blah, blah, blah. So it's probably going to taste like shit. But yeah. we're going to rate it, and we're going to see what's going on. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, let's, uh, again, this one's not a natural casing, so it didn't pop open. It kind of blistered and like blackened, and charred a little bit. But, um, yeah, I guess huh? let's get right into it and see what this says for flavor. That's not bad. It's not bad. I'm not... There's not a lot of flavor. It's, it's natural. It is juicy. But there isn't, yeah. It's nothing like that quarter pound thing. I'm a, if he went for it, he could do this one one day. I bite. wouldn't know. Without well, the big wiener? No, I've never had anything that size in my mouth before either. This one's almost, it's almost like it has, looking at the end of it, still it's still clogged, by the way. It's almost like if I squeeze it, like grease would drip out, like I'm eating yeah. pizza or something. That's it actually is. You know what I mean? It's, it's almost actually, like pretty it's oily. Good. Greasy, it's oily. It's pretty good. And that must be where the flavor's coming mm -hmm. from. And yet, no dampness to it at all. So, no, it's not. The grease is on the inside. Yeah. The juice comes from the inside. Yeah, I guess. You could even be healthy in the hot dog. Yeah, it's surprisingly good for all natural. I've never had a hot dog with no condiments on it. It's quite dry. That's what we want. We can't mix flavors and cause confusion when the rating is stuck. So I'll start. I actually gave it a seven nine. I didn't like the texture on the outside. I prefer them to be crunchy, uh, but it it tasted pretty good and was juicy. I like my wieners juicy. I'll go next. <clears throat> Um, I gave it the 7.5. I thought it was a good wiener. Um, it was, it did have a lot of juicy, almost like oily, and I think that's what's making up for, it, it didn't have a, a lot of flavor though. Yeah. That's where I, I it, it was decent, but 
it was missing a lack of flavor, so that's why I didn't go up in the eight region stuff because it, it was decent, but it needed a little more flavor, a little more snap if I'm going to venture up a, a few more points. But uh, overall, not a bad dog. I wouldn't, I wouldn't not eat it because I feel like you guys are always in that category with the sevens, the eights, which I guess you just like all dogs. But I'm a realist, and I went with a five, America, a five. I love hot dogs. You know, but they're gonna be natural casing, and it's gonna be. Now that was that was good. It was good. I'd probably eat several if I were at a party. I'd eat, you know, swallow as many as I could, and yeah. then just, you know, back to it. But uh, it's a, it's a five. It's, it's a five. A five. Make, make I would sure just question chew. the judgment of an individual who looks like he's eaten one hot dog in his life. <laughs> but anyway, Doesn't everybody's know. got their own opinion. Skinny cooks can't be trusted. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> So, tonight's uh, especially dog, it's nothing crazy, but I'm actually, we're all kind of looking forward I'm to this one. I'm pretty jacked up for this, actually. Um, so, there's nothing like taking a nice, healthy dog and making it um, one step closer to the grave. Um, this specialty dog yes. is... There's some toppings. Underneath there. there, we have Hormel chili with beans, topped with American Easy Cheese out of a can. Oh, and whiz. Then Whiz. Cheese whiz, sorry. Yes. Um, and then that is uh, bacon that's actually making it so you cannot see the dog. So I'm actually kind of excited because this is going to, like I said, it's going to make something that was supposed to be healthy and uh, put us one step closer to the grave. Thank you, sir. Oh <laughs> yes. Ooh, this is going to improve my score. You could probably put a piece of dog shit in here and cover it with chili and... Wow. I put a lot of stuff on that. Oh, my God. That's better. Mm. A lot of bacon on there. Mm. Probably. Yeah. That's a lot of big. Yeah. A lot of aerosol cheese That's as well. I, I didn't go with the cheese. That's good. Oh, boy. The the dog. Like I said, the dog is not Charlie. outstanding, but you put this topping on a natural casing snapperoo. You're going to venture up into the close to nine. That chili is the best and worst thing I've ever consumed. Oh, wow, well, it's right. But with the mix, right? It's not it's, a the flavor is quite good. Uh, <clears throat> I might lick my plate once the camera's off. Yeah. This is just, what the fans have been waiting for. I would for, take right? that spray right. cheese and just blah, 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 all over my face. I know it's, you And when we rate these specialty dogs, it's not necessarily the dog itself. I'm probably right. going to give this a really good score because of the topping. Oh, yep. I'm going to have a napkin. <laughs> yeah. I went 8 4. If you put chili on a toenail, I would shove it in my suck hole. So I'm. I'm I think that was way better. And cheese. Fake cheese out of a can. Was... I'm a little slightly higher. Eight, five. Is that what I said? Yeah. The chili, cheese, and then you add bacon. Like I said, you could put a green bean topped with that, and it's going to be good. Yeah, <clears throat> nothing like turning that healthy dog the wrong way, but yeah, that's why I'm chubby. <clears throat> Go ahead, my skinny friend. See so, what so for me, that dog went immediately to a nine once you put a bunch of stuff on top of it, and that's I'm ready for another whenever we fire when this is over and we fire the grill back up. I'm having another one of those, just the way you made it. I won't adjust anything. The topping is outstanding. Beautiful. Um, just to point out, future guest on the show, we go with the decimal system, so it is a rookie mistake, but, we'll, but it's his first time. 9.0. So, uh, oh, 9.0 now, yeah. But he still had a 5 on the first one, so. Anyway, um, yeah, we use that point decimal system to get really, you got to get in there mm. and get down to the grit. Yeah. It's not always <laughs> one, two, three, four. You got really to give it some thought. Look deep into that yeah, meter and yeah, judge it. Mm -hmm. Just... Wiener rating's not a simple right task. It's mm -hmm. chemistry, math, science, physics. That's chemistry. Yeah. Whatever. Right. You know what I mean. But it's a, yeah. It's a big um, deal. A little bit of gym class. 
I, I want to say hello to Mr. LaRoche up in Rutland. Um, miss you, buddy. We miss you, buddy. Um, thanks for leaving. We had a seat. quarter of a fill-in. Um, um, yeah, yeah. I'm sure you're stuffing wieners from Vermont in your mouth up there and enjoying them. <laughs> we know that's right. Um, yeah. Don't Bring back some good ones. Yeah. Don't have too much fun in your hotel room, but um, yeah, we'll uh, we'll see you next week. Uh, he might be back home for a possible quick review, but we're not sure. So make sure you drop us a line. If you're interested, um, like, share, all that good stuff, and uh, we'll see you next week. Thanks for watching. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Matt. Thank you. Thank you, Matt, yes, for stepping in. That was awesome. Goodbye now. It's hot dog. <laughs>